I'm gonna do a real quick breakdown of my characters and uh, personas that I pursued. So, Skunox was an electronic artist, but he was also a rapper. But then I decided that, well, Skunox was the first persona I ever pursued as, you know, as far as, you know, being a musical artist or whatever. Having an ego, having an agenda, having a plan, you know, living a dream. The second one that I, well, I wanted to come up with different names. And I never really reached a point where I thought it was necessary to have a name. Because the sooner, because like, you know, to a certain point, it doesn't even fucking matter. You know what I'm saying? Because you're just some fucking guy who's making songs and, you know, nothing's probably going to happen. And that's what I think, you know, and I don't like to be negative, but I like to be real. You know, I like to be a realist. I like to be, okay, you know, this is the situation. This is the reality. And you know what I'm saying? It's just, you know, it's just life. But I do like to be positive, too. You know, I like to try my best. I try to take it to the extreme. I try to have everything in my awareness. Anyway, so, you know, I, I got to thinking about different names and, you know, like going through different names, trying to come up with something. And, you know, uh, Shmi Dog. I, um, my family used to call me Shmi when I was a kid. And I have no idea why they just used to call me Shmi. And so I was like, okay, Shmi Dog. And I used to use that name uh, when I was like 13 or something, like online, like email, like Shmi Dog. Um, that used to be what I used to go with, Shmi Dog. And then so, so I went from Skunox to Shmi Dog. But Skunox is like my fucking electronic name, I guess. And so I went to Shmi Dog, and that was like my, my rapper name for a while, and I was Shmi Dog. And, you know, I don't really know. I mean, I felt like it was a little bit corny or some shit. I mean, I don't really know how I really felt about it. But, so I was like, okay, I need to come up with a new fucking... And I'm basically obsessed with this shit. And it's like something I'm obsessed with. Like, dude, I need a fucking name. It's like McDonald's, dude, you know? Like, it's just such a fucking good name. And I watched that fucking movie on documentary on McDonald's, and it's all telling about how... The name was just, yeah, you just had, it's whatever. But um, branding, you know, just the name. And so Shmidaga, I didn't really like, I wasn't really too into it. And then, so I was like, okay. I need something else. You know what I'm saying? I need something else. And then so I came up with Super Fanboy. I felt like, you know, a fan, as a fan, because I feel like I'm a fan. I'm not really an artist. I'm more of a fan, like. I'm doing shit because I'm a fan. Like, I like doing it and shit, you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, okay, super fanboy. And, you know, I, you know the whole boy um, thing is, you know, maybe a little bit cliche because, you know, a lot of people use boy. But I am a big person. I'm a tall person, so I'm like, uh, you know, because you'd like little, little Wayne, you know, little this or, you know, big Sean. What you know, big isn't necessarily too, like, too big. Like, <laughs> that's ironic. Not too big of a thing, but I could do, like, big Seth. Or something like that, you know what I'm saying? Which Big Seth might be better, you know? So I don't know, man. It's like, you know, I just ran through different names and shit. And then I'm just like, well, super fanboy. And that's what I felt like. I, You know, it, it just, I don't know. It just feels like it should be my name. Um, <clears throat> I mean, I don't really know. And because like a, a name can be a big difference. It can give you a huge edge, man, if you have the right name and shit. And and that sounds weird, but it is. It's true, you know what I'm saying? It triggers a person's mind. Like, your name, it, it sets the fucking stage for a lot of different shit. But, you know, I'm just like, I don't even give a fuck, really, because it's like, you know, well, you know, like, I'm probably never going to make it anyway, and, you know, I'm probably never going to be popular. So, like, what does it matter, you know what I'm saying? But... Then again, you have to think about that. Like, your name can help you be popular. It can just be your name, you know? And it is a talent. There's a lot of things that combine with it. But you, like, you, you have to be aligned with that name. It's just, it's stupid. It's just, a, it's just theories. But basically, Super Fanboy is, like, the last stage in me being a rapper. Where I'm like, okay, Super Fanboy is good. I'm going to leave it. And I like the name. And you can do a lot with the name. I feel like I believe in the name, and I think it has some potential. At the same time, I feel like it's kind of corny and all that shit. But I guess it is what it is. I don't know. I don't really know what it looks like to other people, but my friend said it it was all right. So I don't know. And I was thinking about doing something like, you know, there's so many things you can do. Like, I could be named after something. I was thinking about doing Al Component. I think there's actually a rapper called Al Capone. But, you know, there's a lot of fucking different people out there and shit. So, 
Skuinox, people would say, oh my god, it's Skrillex. And they would think that I ripped that name off from Skrillex or something. It's like, no, dude, I, I have nothing to do with Skrillex. Even though I, I make, <clears throat> or I have made dubstep, and I kind of lean more towards, well, I've made all sorts of shit, man. Synthwave, dubstep, electronic, uh, you, know, da- you know, EDM. You know, I've made all sorts of shit. I've made pop music. You know, I, I haven't really done too much country, but I have tried to implement country in to different ways. You know what I'm saying? Like, especially like country rap, I feel like, you know, I could, I actually do kind of live in a country area too. So, I mean, I could do a more of a country thing. Um, but anyways, yeah, my personas are just what they are. I mean, I don't really know. Um, I, I mean, I feel like there could be something better that I could come up with because if you name yourself, here's, here's the thing. If you name yourself out through something that's already like a brand are already popular, you know, like Eminem, like, but it's not spelled Eminem, but you know what I'm saying? Like I've seen it before where, it, and it's like the song title too. People will make it, the name or the song title relevant. So like you can go search for shit and you'll, and you'll find it. You know what I'm saying? So it's like an organic name. So, but you know, I don't know. Um, it's, it's kind of weird. Like, you know, like super fanboy, no one would ever fucking, that's not connected to anything. But if I made my name like, well, I made my name like Wolfkins on Twitch because I was, I, I wanted to change my name. So I went from fucking, I'm trying to come up with a streamer name, you know what I'm saying? And that's different too. Rap name, streamer name. <sighs> but all in all, I think that I, I was like way overthought the situation and way over set, obsessed with it. And just like, you know what I'm saying? Like way far upset. And you know, now I want to change my name again. Like it's weird. And I wasn't going to be super fanboy anymore because the way I think of names and personas is weird because I can do an animation of a persona of a character and that is just a character in the animation and I can go make another one. See, so I can make several different fucking MCs. You know, I can make several different characters. I can make so many different flavors and different things. And that's why I'm saying. It's like whenever you look at, you know, this one fucking name, it's just like, well, you know, it's, you know, it's really whatever, but you know, I think it's a good name just for what it is at the same time, you know, the whole boy thing, like super fan boy, I don't really know if I enjoy it, but I do like it. I do like it. Um, I don't know. I mean, I like the name. It, It has a certain resonance with me. So I don't know. It's weird. It's weird. It's weird, man. But, um, but yeah, I mean, I, you know, like I said, like, I guess, you know, it kind of like, it just, it kind of doesn't matter because I could just come up with any name at any time. You know what I'm saying? Like, and here's another thing. If you, you could be a different rappers at once and you don't really realize it, but you can be different rappers at once. That sounds weird, right? But like, just on the internet, you can be different rappers at once and actually, Like, I don't really know what the laws are if you could technically conceal your identity from people and just wear a mask and shit like that, and people wouldn't know who you really are, because you could be already famous, and you could do, like, a mask, wear a mask or something like that, and you could, like, conceal your fucking identity, and I know I'm thinking of that show, The Fucking Mad Singer, right now, which I do not like that show. I, I, I despise competition shows. I don't like competition shows anymore. I think they're way fucking corny. Just the way people compete in in everything. Like, dude, this is, like, it's corny. I think competitive shows are going down the shitter at some point, but I don't know. Maybe they'll always be fucking popular. I mean, you have every single kind of competitive show you could think of. But, yeah, that's my different personas and shit. I just want to make a video on it.